languages of map the basic elements of a map include a title direction scale signs and symbols these are called the language of a map the language of the map helps us to understand the information given in the map first title the title of the map tell us about what the map is about for example the map with the title political map of india tells us about different states capitals and cities of india direction the direction of a map are shown by a arrow mark in the upper right hand corner the arrow is up straight upright and the tip of the arrow is marked with n it shows the north direction the four main directions can be shown on map these are north south east and west scale maps are the drawings of area on the paper so it is obvious that they are smaller than the areas they represent there has to be some relationship between the map distance and the ground distance this relation is represented as the scale of the map when the distance between two given points on the ground is measured it is called the ground distance the distance between the same two points on the map measured along a straight line is called the map distance the ratio between the map distance and the ground distance is called the scale of the map suppose the distance between two cities is 200 kilometers on the map it is shown as 1 cm the scale is written as 1 cm 200 kilometers the scale is usually thus the scale is used to represent the ratio between the size of the map and the area shown signs and symbols the signs and, and symbols helps us to read and understand the information given on the map we can show physical or culture features on a map with the help of signs and symbols we can show features such as temples mosques churches forts rivers bridges lakes etc with the help of signs most of the symbols are known used by all countries in the world thus this signs and symbols are called the conventional symbols besides this components colors and legends also help us to understand the map besides many colors are used in map these colors denote different things ocean seas rivers and lakes are always shown in blue dark blue color means deep water and light blue color shows shallow water green color shows forest or plain areas mountains and highlands are shown in shades of brown agriculture lands are shown in yellow the color and symbols used in the maps are universal this means every country in world uses the same set of symbols and colors that is why they are called conventional symbols